Hello everyone! In this short video, we're going to show you how you can use Activity Timelines teams to plan your Jira sprints. As you probably know, in Scrum methodology, tasks usually are not scheduled to some specific dates, but rather spread for the whole duration of the sprint. And as we showed in one of our previous videos, you can configure it easily in the settings. This setup works perfectly for the past and current sprints, because tasks are already scheduled to users and you can see their capacity. But what about future sprints? How to plan sprints considering your team's capacity? Don't worry, we got it covered here as well. By using our team panel to see future sprints, you can see all the available capacity of your team for future weeks, as well as potential bottlenecks in your plans. This will allow you to plan a few sprints ahead, without the need to assign tasks to any specific Jira user. Here is how you can achieve the same view for you. Firstly, we need to create team fields in your Jira. You can do that in just a few clicks inside the tool. Open Configuration, Jira Integration and click to create a team field and choose an appropriate name for the field. Once you click Create, the system will create the field and assign it to the correct Jira screens. Secondly, tasks from sprints should be assigned to the appropriate team, but the assignee should be listed as unassigned. Lastly, if you are using story points for estimation, make sure you have configured the conversion for them. We go into details on this in one of our previous videos. Just go to Configuration, Project, manage a particular project and define this conversion. For example, let's put 8 hours per story point. Now each of the story point will be equal to 8 hours. When all this is set, you can now open a team panel and see your tasks from the future sprints allocated to your team. Additionally, you can use our team utilization report to see a full picture of the workload between your individual employees and the teams as a whole. Go to Reports Analytics section, then choose Team Utilization Report, choose your preferred team, choose a time period, and generate the report itself. That's it for now. Today we showed you how you can use our team panel to plan capacity for your future sprints. There is other useful content about Jira and Activity Timeline on this channel, so feel free to check them out whenever you have a free minute. If you still have any other questions, please feel free to reach out to our support, which is support at relikes.com. See you in our next episodes.